Samsung fans, get ready. Samsung has officially released the first teaser for the upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 7, confirming that this next-gen foldable phone will feature significant upgrades in both design and size compared to its predecessor. The teaser includes a revealing GIF that hints at an increased height, slimmer corners, and shiny sides, which could be a nod toward a titanium frame, though Samsung hasn't confirmed that detail yet. The silhouette shown in the teaser clearly suggests a larger device with a new aspect ratio, setting it apart from the Galaxy Z Fold 6. Samsung also dropped a major clue by describing the Fold 7 as offering an ultra experience, a term usually reserved for its top-tier flagship devices like the Galaxy S Ultra or former Note Ultra series. While this raises the possibility of a Galaxy Z Fold 7 Ultra, there's no official word on that just yet. In a press release, Samsung stated, That's why Galaxy's next chapter is to provide an experience that seamlessly blends artistry and engineering to elevate everyday interactions. As expected, Galaxy AI will play a major role. The teaser confirms that the Z Fold 7 will continue Samsung's push into generative AI, offering even more advanced features. Notably, both the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Flip 7 will be the first devices to launch with One UI 8 based on Android 16 out of the box. As a reminder, the Galaxy Z Fold series features a side-folding design with two displays, a cover display that works like a regular smartphone and a larger inner display that turns the phone into a tablet once unfolded. While the inner display still needs some refinement to become fully seamless for everyday use, Samsung has made remarkable progress with its foldable tech, and the Fold 7 is shaping up to be its most advanced iteration yet. Just days after the Galaxy Z Flip 7 surfaced on Geekbench with an Exynos 2500, its larger sibling, the Z Fold 7, has now shown up in a fresh listing. While the Z Fold 7 will feature the Snapdragon 8 Elite globally, the chipset for the Z Flip 7 may vary by region. According to Abhishek Yadav on X, the latest Geekbench 6 scores for the Galaxy Z Fold 7 are 2,617 in the single-core test and 9,369 in multi-core performance. These results are in line with other devices powered by the Snapdragon 8 Elite, though slightly lower than a previous benchmark for the US variant of the Fold 7, which scored 3,022 and 9,307. This new listing is believed to represent the Korean variant of the device, with model number SMMF 966N. It confirms the inclusion of 12 gigs of RAM and an 8-core Snapdragon 8 Elite processor, the same chip used in the Galaxy S25 series, featuring two high-performance cores clocked at 4.47 GHz. The latest leak from ICE Universe just gave us a huge glimpse into what's coming. According to exclusive information, the next-generation Galaxy Z Fold 7 will be the thinnest foldable foam in the world when it launches. We're talking about just 3.9 mm thick when unfolded and 8.9 mm when folded. That's insanely slim even compared to current non-folding flagships. And what's even more impressive is that Samsung is packing a 4,400 mAh battery into this razor-thin body, made possible by adopting new battery and charging technologies. But that's not all. The Galaxy Z Flip 7 is also getting a nice battery boost, with a 4,300 mAh capacity, which is a solid upgrade for a compact clamshell foldable. Samsung's clear focus this year is on optimizing space and power, while keeping the devices sleek, portable, and premium in every way. And it's not just the foldables getting the slim treatment. The leak also confirms that the basic version of the Galaxy S26 will continue the trend of thin and lightweight builds. The new leak has confirmed the price and launch countries for Samsung upcoming trifold phone. Samsung is once again pushing the boundaries of mobile innovation, this time with a device straight out of science fiction. According to reliable tipster Yojish Brar, the much-rumored Galaxy Trifold is officially set to launch in Q3 this year, meaning we could see it between July and September. But here's the shocking part. This revolutionary foldable won't be available worldwide. Samsung is planning an ultra-limited release targeting just two markets, South Korea and China. But innovation doesn't come cheap. RAR notes that this device will launch in limited quantities, with a price tag ranging between $3,000 and $3,500, making it Samsung's most expensive mobile device ever. So why the limited launch and high price? It's a strategic move. So what makes the Galaxy Trifold so special? As the name suggests, this isn't your average foldable. It's expected to feature a triple fold in display, essentially giving users a compact tablet that folds down into a smartphone form factor. Samsung is likely testing the market, gouging interest, and ironing out any issues before going global. South Korea and China are ideal testing grounds. Both markets have a strong appetite for cutting-edge tech, especially foldables. 
If a trifold is well received, we could see a broader release in 2026. We recently got a look at the renders of the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Flip 7. And now, another leak has surfaced that confirms it all. We're quickly approaching the launch of Samsung's next-generation foldables, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Galaxy Z Flip 7, and the leaks are picking up steam. One of the most intriguing recent developments is that the Fold 7 could be incredibly thin, potentially rivaling the Oppo Find N5, which currently holds the title for thinnest foldable. According to the leak, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 might measure just 4.54 mm when unfolded and about 9 mm when folded, making it only 0.1 mm thicker than the Oppo Find N5. That difference is so small, most users likely won't even notice it. On the other hand, literally the Galaxy Z Flip 7 is expected to maintain the same thickness as the Flip 6, measuring 6.94 mm when unfolded. Including the camera bump, the Flip 7 is said to come in at 9.17 mm thick. Here are the leaked dimensions. Galaxy Z Fold 7, unfolded 158.43, 143.14, x 4.54 mm. Galaxy Z Flip 7, unfolded 166.61, x 75.23, x 6.94 mm. While the Fold 7's slimmer profile is certainly a welcome improvement, there are still a few hardware decisions that may leave fans underwhelmed. Samsung is reportedly planning to expand the use of titanium in its upcoming foldable devices, including the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and the rumored Tri-Fold model. A new report from Felix suggests that the company is considering replacing the traditional backplate material with titanium to create slimmer and lighter foldables. This shift follows Samsung's experimentation with the Galaxy Z Fold Special Edition last year, where a titanium component played a key role in reducing both thickness and weight while maintaining durability. The backplate, which serves as the internal hinge support between the folding panel and hinge mechanism, is crucial in foldable design. Samsung is expected to continue using a titanium internal hinge, which despite being challenging to manufacture, offers a thinner, lighter, and stronger solution. The move could significantly enhance the design of the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and the Galaxy G Fold Tri-Fold, making them more refined without sacrificing structural integrity. Samsung previously achieved a 0.6 mm reduction in thickness by removing the digitizer in the Z Fold Special Edition, though that also meant losing S Pen support, something that's unlikely to happen with this year's main foldable lineup. Here's your first real glimpse at the Galaxy Z Fold 7. Samsung is gearing up to unveil the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 this July, and a recent image leak has provided an early hands-on look at one of the foldables, like the Fold 7. The leaked photo showcases a device with a wide cover screen and a real-world in-hand appearance, suggesting that Samsung may have distributed early units to select users for testing. The image reveals the camera side of the alleged Galaxy Z Fold 7, which closely resembles the layout seen on the Z Fold 6. However, Samsung has made a subtle change by repositioning the LED flash toward the center of the camera bump. Another noticeable upgrade is the design with the Fold 7 adopting slightly more rounded corners similar to the Galaxy S25 Ultra. The leak color variant also matches the S25 Ultra's signature hue. Visually, the device appears to offer a wider cover screen, improving usability. Samsung seems to be redefining the cover display experience with the Z Fold 7. The outer screen is expected to grow to 6.5 inches, up from 6.3 inches on the Fold 6, while the inner display could expand to approximately 8.2 inches. These upgrades could make the Z Fold 7 the slimmest foldable in its class. Under the hood, the Fold 7 is expected to feature the new Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 Elite processor, while the Z Flip 7 might run on the Exynos 2500. Both devices will ship with Android 16 and battery efficient displays. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.